Well, Doug Shelley, we still don't know the name of the company that's going to take over naming rights here at the pit, but it seems as though Wise Pies wasn't expecting that change to happen so soon. When the pit became Wise Pies Arena in 2014, not every Lobos fan was a fan of the name change. The pit's so iconic, so it just sounded kind of ridiculous. <laughs> Well, it won't have that name for very much longer. The University of New Mexico asked Wise Pies Pizza and Salad to give up its naming rights to the pit to allow a different company to put its name on it and other buildings on campus, too. From what I know, like UNM needs all the money they can get right now, so I imagine they just took a better deal. The $5 million agreement was supposed to be good for 10 years. Wise Pies had only paid a fraction of that $800,000 before they were notified someone else was offering more. The decision seemed unexpected for Wise Pies who told us they were prepared to see that deal through the end. No, I don't think that's right. If you have an agreement for so much money for so many years, you should hold it up. Wise Pies has seen its share of troubles. We told you last year there were liens on the pizza chain for unpaid tax debt. Wise Pies is now under new ownership and says they're up to date on all of their payments to UNM. The Wise Pies signs will stay up until July 1st when the deal officially ends. Then we'll all have to wait and see what else goes up. So I asked, what do you want to see it named? Dion's? I'm not in favor of stadiums being named after products. And the good news for Wise Pies fans, you will still be able to buy the pizza inside the pit. Live at UNM, I'm Sandra Ramirez, KOAT Action 7 News.